So who will be the next chairman of the Federal Reserve? That's the $8.6 trillion question and one that will be answered over the coming days. So it appears to be coming down to either a reappointment of current Fed Chair Jerome Powell or the appointment of Lael Brainerd. She's an economist who sat on the Fed's Board of Governors since 2014. So what's at stake and why does it matter? Let's break it down. So I reference this as the $8.6 trillion question for a reason. That's the size of the Fed's balance sheet, and I note that it's grown substantially. It's increased $4.3 trillion since the onset of the pandemic. And as we sit here today, just ahead of a plan for the Fed to begin tapering or reducing asset purchases, in effect still growing the balance sheet but at a slower pace and eventually stopping in mid-2022, the next Fed chair will be responsible for managing this process in doing so in a manner that causes the least possible disruption in the financial markets. That matters. And each of the leading contenders will take probably the same measured approach in this important area. So investors should expect a taper under either candidate to be pretty consistent. Then there's interest rate policy. And here's where investors might get concerned. Now, with inflation beginning to check all the Fed's boxes, including a broadening out of inflation pressures and an increase in inflation expectations, particularly over the next several years, many wonder and even worry that the Fed may be behind the curve, leading to a more significant policy move on interest rates next year. And on this score, Fed Governor Brainerd is considered to be more dovish and less likely to hike interest rates earlier than forecast. The market reaction, therefore, to a Fed chair Brainerd may be to price in higher inflation expectations for longer, under the expectation that she would let the economy run hot. In our view, though, there's really not a significant difference to the interest rate policy and philosophy under either candidate. So that leaves us with regulation, and on this score we can observe some differences, primarily that Fed Governor Brainerd may take a heavier hand, particularly on financial regulation, than a Fed chair Powell. The bottom line, however, is that the market likes certainty, and with Fed Chair Powell, we know what we're getting. Powell had some fits and starts early in his tenure, with communication missteps having significant market reaction. More recently, though, he's emerged as a decisive leader, thoughtful decision maker, and a clear communicator. This is critically important, and investors need to be confident in Fed leadership, and this comes with experience. And that really matters, always, but particularly given the significant challenges that the next Fed chair will have to navigate, from the taper to a change in interest rate policy to the inflation debate and the newly expanded employment goal.